Any of you ever been to the Valley? You're like, no, where is that? <laughs> Have you heard of Studio City? It's far, far away. I don't care. I'm happy to drive, because I was taking the bus for a long time. Does anyone take the bus here at all? No. You're like, we live in Hermosa Beach. We're not getting on buses. <laughs> the bus is okay. They have televisions on buses now in L.A. They're freaking fancy. <laughs> They're just like, hey, riding the bus sucks, but we're going to give you some entertainment. Right? Except the problem is, is that they play like 90% Spanish programming. <laughs> Which like, I think is a little unfair because white people get DUIs also. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I love to drink. <laughs> I'm freaking broke. Have you ever been so broke that you go shopping at your parents' house when they're not home? <laughs> well, you're just like, they're not going to miss this roll of toilet paper. Like They shop at Costco. Golf. I'm just really tired of stealing napkins from 7-Eleven every time I run out of toilet paper. <laughs> I'm just like, I'll take a large cup of coffee and 50 napkins, right? I might spill it on the way out. I am happy to be here. I spent a good part of my day today Googling personality disorders. Just because I recently got dumped, and I was just like, I'll find out what's wrong with him. <laughs> It is not me. Now it's me. I like assholes. That's my problem. It's such a girl thing, right? Girls love assholes. Oh, you probably can't say it because you're sitting next to them right now. You're just like, shh, we'll talk on Facebook after the show. I love assholes. I don't know what it is. I think it's just because it's easier when you get dumped, right? Like you get dumped by an asshole, you can just cry to your girlfriends. You're like, he's such an asshole. And they're like, I know, I told you that at Starbucks. <laughs> But you get dumped by a nice guy, you're just like, ugh, it's me. <laughs> now I gotta go to therapy or something. This sucks. I'm okay with it, though. I just really want to be a whore, like, so badly. <laughs> just because I'm broke, and I'm just like, I haven't even liked the last couple guys I've slept with anyway, so I'm like, if you could just leave some money by the bedside <laughs> table. <laughs> that would really help me to pay my rent. I like the women in here. I've never gotten that much <laughs> laughing. Good job, guys. You picked some good women to bring out tonight. <laughs> now, a prostitution should be legal, right? Like, I saw these hookers that were getting arrested, and I was just like, I don't know, I just started feeling bad for them. Like, it just seemed really unfair to me, because I'm like, isn't prostitution pretty much just speed dating? <laughs> right? Like, if we're out on a date, and I know for sure I'm gonna have sex with you, like, I'll take $100 cash over a dinner at the Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> like if we just met I don't know you well enough to eat in front of you anyway so it's gonna be awkward and a total waste of your money no. <laughs> I don't know I'm horrible in relationships I, I, like I don't have you ever just love somebody so much that you just like wish they were dead <laughs> like you're just like why do you have to exist and be on Facebook I hate you <laughs> I just all my relationships just end with some guy just being like why are you crazy like guys love to ask that question right they're just like if you just want to drive a girl insane, just wait till she's like almost out the door and then be like, hey, why are you so crazy? Just, I don't know. <laughs> like, I feel like, I feel like you guys ask us as if we have the answer. I'm like, I don't know either. <laughs> I have no freaking idea. It's like, of course I'm crazy. Every month my body is trying to make a baby. And I have to be like, no, just bleed. I'm sorry, I hope you're not eating. I apologize. <laughs> but like now I'm in my 30s and I've never been pregnant. Like I just have this empty baby hole. It's just been filled with Jack Daniels and regret. <laughs> just friggin' making crazy all over the place. What happens when you don't fulfill your purpose as a woman? I don't know. Like I really want to be pregnant. I just don't want the kid afterwards. <laughs> like I just want someone to talk to for like nine months. Right? Like, pregnant women never look lonely. You're just like, what do you want today? I don't know. Let's go eat. It's a lot of beautiful people here. Are you guys on dates? It's like uh, Match.com. eHarmony. Christian Mingle. It's my favorite. <laughs> Have you seen the commercials for that one? Where they're just like, are you a devout Christian looking for love? But God doesn't have time for you. The internet does. <laughs> oh, that was so fast. <laughs> I'm like a chicken in the oven. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. Your next comic, you're going to love him. He's hilarious. He's been on Comedy Central. He's 
Awesome. Please give it up for Lachlan Patterson.